Right. Episode. I'm playing episode five. New game. Oh, need to get some coffee done with today. Okay, it looks like we're in the office. Okay. I already don't like what I'm looking at right now. Okay, just cars going by. Not bad, not bad. Now, where is the coffee? Right, one of these has to be the coffee. Oh. What would I do there? Needs water. Where's the water? I need. Oh, hold on. Like this, maybe? I'm so smart. I got me coffee. Where's the restroom? Alright, over here. There's someone else here? Oh, someone over there. Who's that? Let's go say hello. What do you want, Sid? I'm trying to get this done. I was just checking if you need anything. Can't these clients ever make up their minds? I know. What keeps you here so late? Just finally finalizing a report. Bro, this guy's like, typing, bro. Oh, not not if it, not the cleanest place. Well, well. Oh. There's someone there. There's someone there. Oh my heart! Well, ma'am, didn't know anyone was here. I'm all, you always gave me a heart attack. I'm so sorry. Should have knocked before I came in. But there usually isn't anyone in this late. Now you're fine. You're just doing your job. Again, I'm sorry. I usually do knock, but I'm a little bit frustrated tonight. Has to slip my mind. Oh, master! Oh my days! I can't read. Why are you frustrated about? Someone keeps throwing coffee cups on the floor all over the office. It's been happening for weeks. That's really rude. Definitely not me, bro. Nah, nah, that nah, wasn't me at all. Well, I don't need to get back to it. Don't want to be here all night picking up coffee. Have a good night. Let me wash my hands. Gotta wash your hands, guys. <laughs> oh shoot, someone's calling me. One second. Hello? Uh, hello? Hey, Harp, it's Mike. Oh, hey, Mike. I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? My battery dies at the worst oh, time. Oh, snap. I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> uh, no, we even cut kidding. out on a, a client. <laughs> um... Uh, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. Uh, work's been overwhelming Damn, lately. Art, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. Yeah. Um, about our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? Just really wanted to see you. And Nora. Uh, no, you I haven't. You a bit annoyed about me calling. Seriously, Harper, this is a bad time. Mike, come on. I'll do it now. That's the Sydney Harper I know. I'm... Sorry if I was being pushy. Yeah, you better not be pushy, man. I'll knock you out left right hook. No worries, Harper. I don't want to stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. I, hey. I'll try. Yeah? I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. Heck no! You know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. Uh, sure. Great. Right. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. Yeah? When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. Ah, what a cheap man. Nora and I were talking and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. Oh, I hanged up on him. <laughs> Alright, let's get back to work. We've got a browser. Oh, yeah, I need to do my rentals, don't I? Alright, let's see. We are going to the wood, Barry. 
So you said under a hundred. Fifth, thirty eight, four, nine, one ninety nine, ninety nine. Looks like it's that one. Alright, private cabin in Woodbury. Two reviews, three and a half stars. Wi it's got Wi Fi. Well, it has Wi Fi, so that works. Looks nice though. Well, you got the booking. Hey, I'm assuming you got sent hundreds, if not thousands, stories sent daily. So I'll give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. Is it going to be like aliens? I'm sorry if someone has written weird, but I was rushed. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Oh, that's this right here. Life at the firm was constant juggle with deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth, which I didn't really leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. Oh, so we are Harper, Sydney. The story takes place during one of those days. One of my college friends, Mike, suggested that we take a weekend to get away to the rural Vermont, which sounded like a perfect break from the cycle of work. And my other friend, Nora, was quickly to jump on board. Plan was simple, rent a small cabin, close our shift Friday, leave, be back Monday. Mike came to pick me up. Yeah, it's very chilly today. I've seen you around, but I haven't had a chance to introduce myself. I'm Gail. I'm Sydney, nice to meet you. You're on the 10th floor, I'm on eight. Ah, how'd you know? I've just seen you a few times getting off the 10th floor when I'm at work. Ah, what do you do for work? Oh, he's a software engineer. Yeah, I'm a consultant. Anyways, have you ever a great rest of your day? Yeah, you too. Pulling into the power park now, you down? Is, is this you? Hello? Going for a hug? That's still how you hug people? Why don't you hug me like you miss me? Uh, yeah, if you uh, just see if you smell good. That's a shout. That's so smart. Nothing is too good for you, Sydney Harper. You look good. Uh, uh, whoa, he's trying to flow with me. Sorry, stuff in the back. We get in our way. I, I left the. Uh, hold on. I left my briefcase in the elevator. Cool truck, though. Why is he looking at me like that? Isn't this weird? We used to dream about escaping our college and now we're here. Trying to escape the life we wanted to live. Funny how that works. Change is just hard. Trying to get adjusted to the new job. How's your new job going? We're working on this project that uses machine learning to predict market trends. It's pretty cutting edge. Ooh! Sounds like you're shaping the future. Not quite. Tony Stark yet, but I'll, I'll take it. You know, I never understand what consultants even do. We consult. That sounds like... Important work. Yeah! How do I see them? It's nearly 5 p.m. and I haven't received a confirmation text from you. I just wanted to check in. We're on our way. Should be around there. 6 p.m. The snow slowed us down a bit. Thanks for checking in. How far is it from now? It should be an hour and a half from here. You know, driving through the snow kind of feels like we're traveling through the intergalactic space. What? Look at the way snowflakes swirl around the headlights. It like stars and galaxies rushing past us. Fair enough. Oh my days, don't tell me we're gonna actually like go into the past. It's kind of beautiful. Like me! Yo, Harp, check this out. What? Oh my days, this is a Dairy Queen and a pizza! Pizza! No, I'm not getting pizza. Don't even know. Oh. This pizza is exactly where it appeared on my GPS. It's like living in the future. I'm so hungry, I think I can eat a whole pizza myself. Me too. All right, Operation Pizza Pit Stop is a go. Prepare to land. Are you gonna open the door for me? No, you're just gonna walk, oh. Oh, what a nice guy. Hello. Looks like a cold got everyone craving pizza tonight. You fine folks know what you want. We get three slices each. I'll go as pepperoni, cheese, and veggie. I'll go as cheese, cheese, and cheese. Uh, that should cover us. Just a pizza for today. Alright, thanks. You don't have a drink with your pizza? Friends, three ever. Nora Kim. Oh, you guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. I'm not going to bore you with all of the details. The long and short of it is one of my clients needs a last minute change. Their payments are about the only thing keeping the lights on. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. There's so much. Happy. Damn, that piece of slaps. Tell me about it. Can't believe Nora's missing out on this bomb pizza. Oh, bro, these sounds. Oh, I don't like these sounds. Ah, it's like inside of my cravities. 
Hello, my friends. Oh, no, it's not you again. Hello. I saw y'all driving up in a nice truck. That's right. Not to be bother or anything, but I was heading down the road myself. Seems like you might have be going the same direction. You mind if you ride with us? Where's your car? Who needs a car when there's fine friends like you to pass the time? Y'all wouldn't even know I was there. Quiet as a church mouse and twice as nice. Oh, I don't know, I don't know. I'm not sure, I'm sorry. Surely you can just a little bit of room for me. Hell, I even ride in the bed. It's my friend's car, sorry. You know there's a middle seat? You scared of me or something? Sorry, I ain't too kind to you, are you? Unkind pe people meet unkindness themselves. You're the best, careful work, well, okay. Are you threatening? <laughs> Why is he doing like that? Yeah, you threatening us. Yeah, get out of here. Alright, Nora, what she said, what she said, what she said, what she said. XD, okay. Alright, I'm going up. I'm going to the toilet. Oh no, in the dustbin. Thank you, sir. That was very good. Alright then, are we ready to hit? Yeah, let's go. Give me the keys. Harp, the weather is awful. Why don't you just why don't you drive part of the way home? I'm going to drive so you can get a break. I'm afraid of what kind of break you're going to give me. <sighs> Just give me the keys. On one condition. I get first choice of bedrooms when or if we get there. Deal. Oh, I get to drive! Oh wait, now I'm in America. I have to go this side. Oh, I am, actually, this I'm driving. Let's go! Your hometown station, bringing you the best tunes to warm your hearts on this chilly... Oh. Hey. Oh. Hey. Oh. I'm connected to Oh, sorry, police officer. And besides, no one can take a rub and out of my life. I think the words come together well, and that's no coincidence. Trying to be the you have to... I could be without no Do you remember the address? I think the address was 241 Woodbury Boulevard. Might be this one. So, what's the number? Are we getting out or what? And this should be it. I thought you were just gonna keep driving that. Oh, this is it. Okay. Walk over the map. It was quite a quite a quite a little house in the quiet neighborhood. That's not bad. Oh, what a nice house. Well, great place. I knew we could count on you. Smells nice in here too, right? But I can't really hit the John. Take your time, Mike. While I'm gone, can you put those groceries away? I can find enough space in the fridge. I got it. Whoa! Oh my days, what's happening? <laughs> put that in there, some eggs. Bell peppers, lettuce, milk, and some more milk. And some frozen yogurt. Sorry about that, Harp. Are you okay? Long drives and all that pizza really did a number on me. No worries. Anyway, this place is crazy nice. It's got all that rustic charm. Just don't see any more. Yeah, it's cute. For sure. I really had to need to pee. I'll be right back. You can go ahead. I'll start unpacking up our bags. Thanks. Okay. It's our utility room. <laughs> oh my... Oh... <sighs> Oh, hey, you're here. Who are you? Welcome to my home, sweet home. What a lovely young couple. No, no, we're not a couple. You didn't have to sell it that hard, Harp. I was just answering his question. He didn't ask the question, Sydney. He made a statement. Oops, a daisy, silly me. Didn't mean to cause a stir. We didn't expect you to be here. Oh, um, I was out looking for my cat earlier and remembered I had a TV on before. Oh. Just thought, but I'll try to get it working again. Since the last few folk left a bad word for it. You know, they say treat your customers like family. My family doesn't go out without TV. I respect that. Speaking of that, all you folks here left. Alright, right now, show me. Show me the tour. Alright, fair enough. 
Here's your shower. That'll make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall. Oh, and this sink doesn't work, unfortunately. Do not worry, I'll get it fixed for y'all real soon. Let me show you the other bedroom. Look up, this room has a nice view. Yeah, I think that's a nice mister. Wait until I show you the deck. Follow me. Oh? Okay. Oh wow. This is incredible, definitely. It's really cold though. Glad you folks like it. This is one of my favorite spots. The view of the creek is beautiful. It's a great spot for fishing too. All right, folks, just heading back inside before I catch a cold here. And here's the storage room. If you need anything, extra blankets and whatnot, it's all in here. The power it ever goes out, you can use this flashlight here on the right. Storms like these, you never know. Thanks. All right, folks, let's head downstairs now. All right, folks, see you already stocked up in the fridge with some tasty food. You see the knob turns the knob more for cooling and Tom turn it the other way to turn it off. I tend to keep it on low in the winter, the bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, I better show you folks the water heater. Oh? Oh no, not in the basement. No access to guests, okay. Um, nothing to worry about down here, just a water heater and some old storage stuff. If ever stops working, just hit the button and... The pilot light will fire back right, right up and you'll be back in business. Thank you. Hit the button. Okay. Hey sir, what's the deal with that room over there? Nothing you two need to concern yourself with. I kind of use that basement as storage as renters don't need the space. That you really ought to keep upstairs. Okay, well, I was just curious. Let's move on. Are oh, you already know I'm going to go in there. Did I mention? Well, no. I want to keep it myself. The fella brought, the fella I bought this house from. Well, told me his mother died down here. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night. Said they can hear something shuffling around down here. Not to scare your folks, but if I were you, I wouldn't really step down here. Nice. Good to know. Hee hee hee. The looks on your faces. Come on now. I'm just joking. I hope he probably isn't. All right, folks. <sighs> Let me try that again. All right. All right, folks. Snow's starting to pick up. I'm going to hit the road now. Got to find that damn cat. Thanks for showing us around. Enjoy finding that cat. That guy was super weird. I can't lie. Very weird. All right. Let's see if there's anything going on in the TV. Actually, cool. Cool. I'll find something while you're watching it while you're in there. Let me know if it feels like you're under a waterfall. See you in a bit. Alright. La 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 la. La la dee da da do. La da 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 dee. What does that sound? Why do you have a fishing rod? Check this out, I found the fishing rod. Yeah, you were you gonna plan to catch the dinner, yeah? Now that you mentioned it, that'd be a pretty epic addition to the trip. Let's do it. Hell yeah, follow me, there's another rod in the shed. So we can both give it a shot. Wicked! If you wanna grab the other rod hub, yeah, give me just give me a second. Where is it? What? Where's the rod? Oh, there. Oh, snap. I saw a killer recipe for bait carp. We need to catch three uh, three carp, though. You up for the challenge? Yes. Well, first things first, we need the right bait for the carp. Check out the information. Whenever you are ready, grab the carp bait. Let's head into the creek where we're going to catch some carp harp. All right. Let's grab some bait. Oh, can we sit down and do it? Let's see. Is he going to sit down? Yep. Hope those carps are biting today. I uh, see. Let's see if I can catch him one. Wicked. Oh no, he's bait. He's he's uh, fishing.
Light work. Look at me go. Look at me go. Look at me go. Look at me go. Oh. Yeah, I played Stardew Valley in my time. Goldfish. Keep. No, we want carp. This has to be it. Watch. This has to be it. Yes! I got one! Finally! If I just leave it there? Ah, oh, very close to just leaving it the whole time. Oh, I don't want no blue girl! Watch, this, this is it right here. Boom. Alright, let's do it. You want to head back and throw it in the oven? I'm letting you go in first, just in case there's someone there so that you can protect me. I'm just a little damsel in distress. Did it I swear I closed that door. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, all these doors are closed. Did I not close this door? While I'm cleaning the fish, do you mind prepping the marinade? Sure, it will just take a bowl. Throw in some ginger paste, cooking oil, black pepper, salt, and Italian seasoning. Paprika and yogurt. On it. Grab a bowl. Uh, frozen yogurt? No. Yeah. What else? Salt. Pepper. Ginger and garlic paste. Italian seasoning. Where's olive oil? Paprika and olive oil. Where's olive oil? Light work. Those carp are going to taste them. I hope so. While we wait for the cook, how we play some board games? Sure, why not? I'll grab whatever catches your eye. Can't wait to see what you pick. Alright, let's go, let's go. Oh, here. Uh... Oh, you already know. Oh snap, there's a Ouija board? Yes. Holly once told me she contacted with her dead grandma through the boards once. I can't stand her spiritual stuff. Hey. Remember how that... Oh, should we try it down there? Yeah, let's try it. Ah, oh, it's not going to go well. Okay. Oh, I don't like this. Anyways, do you know how this works? No. So here's how it works. First, we place our fingers lightly on the pang shatter. We have to ask the questions and spirits if there are any will move the pan to spell the answers. Or at least that's what Holly, Molly told me. All right, then you go first. Uh, are there any spirits who want to talk to us? Um, me. Um, J. Um. No way, you're moving that. That wasn't me. Okay, I got one too. Go ahead. How's your afterlife treating you, buddy? Hey, be respectful. Oh. Do you live in this house? A L A Alala Who the freak is Alala? Ah, your turn. Come on, buddy. Give us a sign that you're here. G What the hell is that? Wait for me. And usually no one believes in ghosts or spirit. Oh gosh. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. I didn't feel easy. Yeah, bro. I do not like that. Why did we do that? Why did we do that? There's some freaky stuff going down on there. Harp. That was weird. What do you mean weird? You left me. What the hell, Harp? I figured you would move your ass too. What do you mean ass you had checked? Have you ever heard of fight or flight? Sydney, I'm sorry, okay? Don't even talk to me. You wuss. Bro just took it out with his bare hands. What a giga chad. Had to grab a plate. Let me grab a plate. I think our show is about to come on. Would you like to watch it? Sure. This looks nice though. We got to catch the TV show 
on while we eat. Where's the controller? Oh, I'd have to turn it on myself. The spoonful of mayonnaise. Oh? This delicacy is very popular in Romania, where mayonnaise flows down the rivers. Like mayonnaise doesn't flow mayonnaise down... water. No, it... So first, we are going to prepare the asparagus. Season these with a lot of salt. Salt is good for the bones. That's true. After letting these simmer in the salt bath, we can start making the chocolate. And take a chocolate and mayonnaise. Beans. What? Uh, yes, I was done with it. Cocoa beans need to be blended. How's that food? It was alright. You don't have to rain my parade hub. It was it was no Moe's pizza, but I thought it'd turn out well. Hey, anyways, the next thing we I need you to check my emails mayonnaise. real quick. Left my laptop we upstairs. Thought you were taking a break. A it's not Irish work. I'm just waiting on shipment details for my new DS. I'll be right back. All right, this I'll just clean up. Like it, it la da dee, la da doo, la da da, la da da, la da dee, la da doo, la da da, la da dee, la da doo, la da da, la da da. It requires a lot. I think there's someone under my bed right now. Can you come upstairs? Lucky I didn't break your nose. My good uh, looks are half the charm. Don't mess with them up. I totally got you. Oh, why are you doing that to me? 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 Want to go for the next round? Next round? How about a game of hide and seek? Fine. All right, you're on. I'll count to ten. Where should I hide? I decided to hide in the basement. Why? Oh no. This woman's just making everything worse for herself. I decided to hide in the nook underneath the stairs. I got you. Aw, oh, man. That wasn't even a challenge, so I figured you are good at it. Okay, maybe you need to look harder. Alright, my turn to hide. You better close your eyes and start counting. One, two, three. One minute to see. Ready or not, here I come. I'm about to find him in like one second. Not there, not there. Probably gone upstairs. Yep, it's gone upstairs. Maybe he's in the toilet? No. Not there. No. Aha! Got you! Hang on, Harb. I think I heard something upstairs. You gonna try this again? No, no kidding. Sydney, I really heard something. You, you didn't hear it? No, I did not. I swear on my life I heard something. I see the attic. access that door in here. You gonna have to. You gonna check it out? Alright, let me check it out. Uh, use the footstool behind you to climb up. Where is it? <gasps> what the fuck is that? Oh, it's a cat. Hello. Hello, tiny one. You're going to come down now. 
Are you okay? What's up there? It's just a cat. Oh, that's a relief. I was worried there for a minute. I think she's hungry. Oh, yeah? Maybe we can give her one of the carp after I come find you again. Uh, okay. I decided to hide in the tool shed in the backyard. Why are you playing hide and seek again? We're like 30 years old. Are we not? <laughs> what a noob. Ah, man. Took me a while to figure out where you left. Anything worth doing is doing well. That's true. Hey, close your eyes, pretty eyes now. I'm getting tired. Look, I'll hide in the house. We're headed back in there anyway. Come find me when you go to bed. And we'll go to bed. Okay. Da, da, da. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, six, seven Mississippi, eight Mississippi, nine, ten Mississippi. I'm coming. Nope, nope. Alright, he's not there. They're coming from upstairs? He didn't go upstairs, did he? Oh, I'll check. Nope. <laughs> oh my days, man. What's going on? What happened? Well, hey there. Why are you still here again? I'm fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that? You should have told us. Miss, this is my house. I don't need to check in whenever it's... Okay. I've never seen someone fix a faucet with a hammer before. You ever fixed many faucets yourself, young man? I didn't think so, so I managed you don't know what tools you need. Isn't it late for you? No trouble for me at all, miss. I'm right around the block. I told you, if you get sick and done, I'll get it real soon sorted out. Alright, we need to go to bed. You asking me to leave, miss? No, Rook, she's being polite. We rented this house and we'd like to have it to ourselves. I don't really want to have to call a law enforcement. Ain't no cops in Woodbury, son. You think they're going to arrest the home owner for fixing Fortslet? Okay, this guy's so annoying. You know what? If folks don't like me fixing the faucet, I'll leave you to it. Yeah, please do. He's so weird. Unironically, he's so weird. Don't tell me it's going to be one of these. Oh, after look oh my dears, I'm so dumb. We debated what to do. We agreed there's something off about Rick from the start. If you seem to really enjoying making excuses to come over and announced. It ended up, we decided Rick was weird and probably harmless. So we attributed his behavior to extreme lack of social awareness. Look, we already drove all the way out here. Let's enjoy yourself, Mike said. But by the time I'm feeling very tired, I decided to get some rest. Bro's going to like appear in my room. Hmm? What's up? Hard to, <laughs> Hard to sleep when someone's knocking on my door. Do you mind if I come in? I'd like to talk about something. Sure. What's up? The storm is starting to get really bad. I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. I hope Nora's okay. Should be just fine, Sydney. Don't worry, I'm here to keep you safe. What? Hey, it's no problem at all. Guys are supposed to watch over people they care about, right? What are you even talking about? What a day. This wasn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. I know, right? Can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering into our house like he owns the place. I mean, he does own the place. But you know what I mean. Yeah, I know, I know. 
I mean, this guy probably is harmless, but it's frustrating. Uh, me too. It'll help if we both get some sleep. Why don't you come sit with me? Oh no. Oh dear, oh dear. What's he gonna do? Harp, you know. I missed this. Us just talking. It's been so long. You know. You don't have to sleep alone if you don't want to. Where's this coming from? Uh, I remember it being pretty awkward. Trip to Oregon. It didn't start off awkward though. Mike, we had a lot to drink. Things happened. They sure did. I'm hoping maybe they can happen again. Uh, SOS, please. Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury and my stinking tire just blew out. <sighs> what a timing, but I guess we can't leave it stranded. All right, no, we can't. We better get ready. No, Sydney, you stay here and get some sleep. There's no sense in both of us freezing our asses off. Oh, dear. He's going to leave me in the house with the old man. Yeah, I'm sure you're in pajamas and I'm still dressed. You just sew it in and I'll help Nora. Be careful. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. We'll finish talking about this later, okay? Get some good rest to stay warm. I have to lock the front door, that's true. Hey, don't you get some rest while I'm gone? Uh, yeah, I think I'll crash for a bit. Make sure you take care of yourself, alright? Look at all the doors, you sound like dad. Can you blame me? Uh, sure. Have a hug. I went through the wall, let's go. Sweet dreams, guess all right, try safe. How do I lock the door? I was keen on getting some sleep until Mike and Nora arrived. Never alone in an Airbnb. I don't like that. Told myself what seems to get better. Nora always knew how to cheer me up. It was her arriving soon. I decided to get some rest in the meantime. Oh no, someone's going to walk in. Who is it? Oh my days, is it? Look friend, I know it ain't ideal banging on the door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here. I was continuing on a ride from some friends, they were running behind and won't be here for a few hours or more. You're not coming in, end of story. You're gonna let me freeze to death. I didn't make you go hiking in the snow, that's true. I should have known you were. Oh, wow! Okay, calm down, bro. Get out or I'll call the cops. Ain't no cops around here. Speaking of, I don't see your fella's truck out here either. I'm dialing 911. Fine. Suit yourself. Where's the phone? How do I dial? Where's the phone? But let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you leaving me out here. Calm as a... The man door seemed irrelevant compared to how tired I was. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to bed. Lock my door. Lock the door. Lock the door. How do I lock the door? I don't know.
What was that? Okay, okay, I need to text Rick. Rick, I'm sorry to bother you again, but can you come over? There's someone we met down driving, he's banging on the door, I'm pretty scared, I think he's moving outside the house. Can you please come over and look, since you live close? Rick? What am I doing? Can I just go back to bed? I need to call for help. How the freak do I call for help? Where's the ca Where's the phone? Bloody hell, where's the phone? Where's the phone? Ah, oh, no, who's it? Oh, it is. Thank you. What the hell's going on here? I'm so happy you're here. Explain the situation. Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. Why? By the way, where's your friend, the guy who was with you earlier? He should be back soon. Hmm. So you're all alone here right now, yeah? Why'd you make his weird? What are you doing? Storms like this bring out all kinds of folk. Not all of them know how to stay away. What did he do to the guy? What do you mean? I live in Birmingham. I haven't rented in weeks. Hello? Everything okay, miss? Yeah. Awfully wait for texting. Who's it? My friends are almost here. Is that so? You can head back if you want. Are you sure about that? Yeah, I just overreacted. Maybe I should stick around, make sure everything's really okay. I need you to leave right now. This is my house, I'll leave whenever I want to. What do you what do you want? I want what's mine, this house, and you. You're trespassing. Get in this house before I call the cops. I don't think so. If anyone's leaving this house. It'll be one of us. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs>